Okay, so let's solve this problem. So find the derivative using the limit definition. And this is the formula in solving for the derivative using the limit definition. Now take note that in the formula, the numerator has two terms. So the first term, x is equal to x plus h. So from the given, y equals square root of x minus 3. So we have now y prime equals the limit as h approaches to 0. Then substitute this x plus h to x. So for the first term, so we have now the square root of x plus h, then minus 3. Then uh, minus, so the second term, we have this f of x. Then since f of x is equal to y and y is the given, so therefore the second term is the given, then over h. Then to simplify this equation, we need to find the conjugate of the numerator, then multiply to both sides. Now, since the sign is uh, minus or negative, so the conjugate is plus or positive, but multiply to both sides. Then simplify. Now, when multiplying the conjugate, so we have this x plus y times x minus y. The shortcut method for this one, the square of the first term minus the square of the second term. So therefore, the square of the first term then minus the square of the second term. Then for the denominator, you just copy, then simplify so we can cancel now this radical. So we have x plus h minus 3. Then minus, cancel the radical, that's x minus 3. Then over the denominator, then uh, we can uh, omit this parenthesis. So we have x plus h minus 3. Then this negative distribute to every term, negative x and positive 3. Then copy the denominator. Then combine like terms on the numerator. So we have this positive x, negative x, so cancel, that's 0. Negative 3, positive 3, cancel, that's 0. So therefore, y prime equals to the limit as h approaches to 0. So for the numerator, we have h. Then copy the denominator. Then we can cancel this h. So we have now 1 over the square root of x plus h minus 3 plus the square root of x minus 3. So this time we can substitute now this 0 to h. So that becomes y prime equals 1 over this one is 0, that's h. Then x plus 0. So that's. Uh, x minus 3 plus x minus 3 because h now this one is 0. Then square root of x minus 3 plus square root of x minus 3. So you just add the number outside. So the derivative now, so y prime is equal to 1 over 2 square root of x minus 3.